Hi there, and welcome back to GS Pro V2 Tips. Today, I want to talk about an interesting question that I've been asked a few times by various people, and that has to do with Patreon. How do I go about adding courses created by Patreon uh, creators? In other words, those, those golf course designers that have private Patreon sites how do I go about getting those courses into my GS Pro Online? And so here I am creating a video just for that purpose. So first of all, I recommend going to www.patreon.com. Once there, you go ahead and click up here to start a paid membership. There you're gonna be asked to log in because I already have one. I'm just gonna simply log in. I did it easy with Google. From that point, once you are done with that, once you get logged on, click on the left hand side and find a creator. And in this particular case, let's find TechBud. TechBud Designs. There we go. Once this page comes up, you'll see all the latest information. But what you're not going to see, because I have logged out, make sure is that you're not going to see any of the posts because it requires you to be a paid subscriber. Here you can see the post, but you can't see the details and you certainly cannot get a list of his courses. But if you notice here, this server link is going to be available as long as you join. So once you have logged into Patreon, you have now can go ahead and join this particular Patreon's site and then subscribe. His minimum is $5 a month. You can also explore his other membership options that are available, as well as what those are going to cost you and what you get for each and every one of those. If you want to make your own pricing, you can make a custom pledge down here at the bottom. Now, once that is complete and you have become a member, when you do actually click the server link course, you'll actually get the link that will come up. Once you get the link, you copy it from the Patreon site and you go into local match. You go over here to this little button over here with the page looking out down arrow joint and you click that and that will bring you up your core server. Now you have three that you begin with. This is the basic GS Pro core servers and you see this add URL right here. Well that add URL button is exactly where you need to paste that which you just copied into your clipboard. Now I'm going to hide that screen while I paste in the TechBuds um, information there. So that way it's not revealed. And once that's done and you've pasted the URL in, you simply add course. Once you've added the course, click close, click close. Once you have added the course server, from Patreon, come over to the game and hit clear course cache. Now clear out everything that it knows about courses. Once that's complete, hit reload courses and you'll go out and reload what's out there. Click save. And now by selecting show all courses and we can even sort by availability, we can go out and see what new courses he has currently available. So the newest one, uh, just a few two days ago is Aaron Hills and now we should be able to see Aaron Hills in our list of courses and there it is to grab it simply download it and now that I'm a member I can see all the wonderful courses the Cascades he was released as a recent release there it is that's one of my favorite courses that's near and dear to my heart um, all right let's take a look downloading Aaron Hills all right, so now that we have it, we can load it up and we can play it till our heart's content. And just like that, Aaron Hills. 
If you have anything else that you'd like to know or have a topic that you think is worth talking about, sorry, give me a shout, leave me a comment, but most importantly, subscribe, like the video, and share it with others that they too can learn more and more about this wonderful game called Golf, a GS Pro. Thanks and watch and uh, see you next time.